Hey, what's up, fellas? How you doing? Man, it's here. Hey, what's going on, everyone? How we doing? Matt Antonelli here. Today, we're answering your questions, your hitting questions. I had everyone send questions over on Instagram and on YouTube. We've got a lot of them. We're working through all of them right now. I'm also down in my basement hitting. Uh, our facility, with COVID and everything going on, we have to wear masks. It makes it a little bit difficult or more difficult to film. I figured it'd be a lot easier to just do it down in my basement until finally we're able to get back in the facility with no masks. And I'll start filming there again. Okay, so today's question is on the head during the load. And they said, you know, is it okay or is it bad if my head is moving back when I'm loading? So we're going to talk about the load. We're going to kind of talk about what the head should be doing. If you've enjoyed this video and want to learn more about building the elite swing, check out our new course. We have over two hours of content, almost 30 hitting drills. We break down the exact mechanics that you're going to want to implement into your swing. I've put the link in the description if you want to go check it out. So let's just start right off and say, if your head is moving back during your load, then you are probably swaying back like this. And if you are swaying back in your load, well then you're probably going to sway forward during your stride, and now your weight is gonna get transferred to your front side too early. So you're gonna shift all of your weight out here and then you're gonna to try to swing and your swing is gonna be slower. Your timing isn't gonna be as good. Your bat path isn't gonna be good. And so there's gonna be a lot of things that kind of break down, okay? So I don't want to, in my load, I don't want to sway back. Sun's starting to come up. I got up early today. As you can see, the sun is coming up and it's getting in my eyes. I'm gonna move over a little bit. I don't want to sway this way. When you're watching your swing on video, right? Put the camera right here, right where it is right now, and watch yourself. So one, if your head's moving a whole lot, probably because you're swaying. Two, look at the knee and the hip of your back leg, okay? So if you start to sway like this, or you notice that your knee is directly over your back foot and your hip is directly over your back knee, you're probably swaying back, all right? Now, if you are swaying, how do we correct that? What should it look like? All right, I'm gonna move this T out of the way a little bit here. Now, when I load and I get ready to hit, we're just gonna talk about lower body for right now. What I'm trying to do very simply is I'm trying to, one, get my back pocket. So this back pocket right here, I'm trying to get this back pocket turned slightly towards the pitcher, okay? So I'm trying to get this move right here. If I do it from this angle, I'm trying to get right here, all right? Now, when I make that move right here, right? So I start to do this. Notice how I'm not swaying back. Is my head moving back slightly? Yes, yeah, slightly, but I'm not swaying everything back, okay? Now I take my back pocket and I start moving it towards the pitcher. When that happens, my hips are gonna start to just close just a little bit like this, all right? So I'm gonna start to coil. When I start to coil now, right? So my back pocket's turning, my hips are coiling. Now this back leg is gonna start to turn back this way. When I swing, my leg is gonna turn like this. When I load, it loads back in the opposite direction, right? So this is getting my lower body and this leg loaded so that I can then stride, hold my, keep my leg loaded as I stride, and then my leg turns, okay? But again, there's not a lot of swaying involved. I'm not swaying back and forward. Again, if I sway back, I'm gonna sway forward. I don't wanna sway forward, right? I wanna load my leg back by doing this. Now when I stride, I hold that, and then I swing, okay? 
Can your head move forward during the stride? Yes, it can move forward. So you're not gonna do this. Sometimes people send me their swings, they try to do this, then they try to stride, they try to keep everything back like this. That's not good either. So once I get my leg loaded, I can stride forward and my head can slide forward a little bit. It shouldn't push forward, that's the key. Don't push forward, and again, if you see a lot of head movement back and forward, like, like the question, sway back, head move back, all of a sudden your head's gonna jump forward a lot, that's not good, okay? So hopefully this makes sense, right? So the head is, is good to watch, but also watch the knee and the back hip. You don't want everything when you sway back to be stacked like that, right? I want to be able to turn my back pocket, get my hips coiled, my leg lows back. You should typically see the knee slightly inside the foot and the hip slightly inside the knee, all right? That would be a really good position to get to, to get ready to hit. Hopefully this answers your question. Thanks so much. Put more questions down below if you want other questions answered. That's all we have for today. Give the video a thumbs up, please. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell, all that good stuff. And we'll talk to you later.